morning, good morning, Alphas, how you doing? Uh, I feel better. I feel a lot better. My um, my leg isn't hurting me anymore. I think it really was the inflammation that I was going through. But your boy is feeling really good. I can't wait to hit them stairs. I can't wait to hit the gym. My schedule today is wide open. So we're gonna be getting a lot done today, all right? So today is just gonna be straight cardio, straight cardio, straight cardio. And I'm also gonna incorporate some leg workouts today because it's been a while since I actually hit the gym hard. And I'm not going to hit the gym hard, but I really wanna start building up my legs more because if I'm gonna be doing these stairs a lot, I wanna make sure that my legs are good. So. Yeah, so I now have a high respect for YouTubers that produce infotainment videos. I have a huge respect for it because, let me tell you, it's difficult. It's not easy. I hope you guys are really enjoying what I'm doing on Saturdays because each and every Saturday, four Saturdays out of the month, I should say, um, I'm gonna be providing you with my Life Light series and I hope I'm helping you. I hope I'm informing you while I'm informing myself because really and truly that series is meant to not only assist you, but assist me. It forces me to do the research I need to help myself, to make myself healthier and make myself better. But at the same time, I don't wanna hoard the information. I wanna make sure that I'm sharing the information with you guys, because you're my family. You know, that's what we do. It takes a long time to film, edit, <laughs> and produce these videos because quite frankly, it's not as easy as just putting the camera in your face. And it's not as easy as just blurting out the information. I mean, there's many takes. I saw once Matthew Santoro, right? I saw once that he showed some bloopers on how he does his videos. And when I saw it up front, right, I was just like, nah, it can't be that difficult, you know? And I'm, saw, I'm seeing him do take after take after take after take. And I'm just like, wow, you know, if the words are right there and, you know, you did the research, you should be familiar with it, right? But there's something about the camera, for me at least, that puts on a different um, aspect of stress slightly. Because you wanna make sure you're giving the information right. You wanna make sure that you're giving the information in such a way that it can be entertaining, but also at the same time, you wanna make sure that the audience is being captivated, right? And it brings on a different level of stress, even though you set the line right, you may have not said it exactly in the way you wanted to say it. And there's just a whole lot that plays into that. So I just wanted to share that because I want you to really truly know that I'm working hard to make sure you're, you're happy, to make sure that you're getting everything that I have to really offer you. And I hope what I'm doing for right now is enough with the time that I have available to me. So let me know in the comments, you know, if you're liking what's going on so far, if there's anything I can really change, uh, if you'd like to see anything different. I did get some feedback from an alpha um, asking me to change the Sunday sit down to Q&A Sunday. Now, I thought about it. When I got the email, it made sense, and I, I thought to myself, okay, let me really think about this and see what I can do, because it was pretty catchy, and I sat there, I sat there, I even asked Chris, and I, I, I just came to the conclusion that I'm going to change it to that, so thank you, Alpha, for giving me that suggestion. It's our channel, it's not just my channel, so anything that I can do differently that's going to help it to make it better, to make it um, more interesting, that's what I'm gonna do. So that's proof in the pudding that I'm listening to you 
and that should really show you that I'm here, I'm real, and I'm really paying attention to what you're saying and how you're feeling and how the information, the vlogs are affecting you. Now, this Saturday coming up, I have something special for you guys. I, I've never told you what my fourth video would be, and after this Saturday, you're going to really know what it is. I, sorry about that. My um, battery actually died just now, but real quick, what I was trying to say was... What was I trying to say? What I was trying to say... Oh, what I was trying to say is this upcoming Friday, uh, you guys are going to finally get to see what it is I've been preparing for you for the last lifelight video of the month. Because every, every week, uh, I'm giving you something different. And um, I've been working on the collaboration for this one for some time. And I hope you like it. It's going to be something very different than what you're used to seeing on the Lifelight videos. It's going to be fun. It's going to be just chill, man. It's going to be a chill environment. And you guys are going to get to see me in a different light. So... Hope you appreciate it. Uh, about to head into work, and I'll holler at you guys in a little bit. I forgot to tell y'all, I'm feeling great. Just like in my life fitness video where I was talking about how it takes about a week for you to start feeling the effects of stair climbing, I am. You know, aside from the inflammation I had that we discussed. I'm actually feeling a lot better. Um, I'm not really as winded as I was. Uh, I did the stairs this morning and it was not as difficult as it was last week. Now, was there some difficulty in it? Yeah. Um, did I overdo myself? Absolutely not, especially with the inflammation that I had. Um, I took it a little easier, but I still did the same amount of stairs. I didn't increase or decrease the amount of stairs that I do. I slightly decreased the time in which I did it, meaning that I walked just slightly slower. But walking up the stairs, whether you're doing it at a fast pace or a slow pace, it's still going to put some stress on your body. Um, and quite frankly, I I felt really good about it. I felt really good about it. And my legs, my legs are feeling good. Um, of course, they have... Um, a little bit of soreness to them, but it's expected. So I'm going to go to the gym in a few minutes. I just wanted to holler at you real quick and let you know how I'm doing for the day. I'm doing good. <laughs>